there and see if we can nail something. Say so nice white water. I say to try the beach, it's a bit too sketchy. But the cast on this lure is really, really good. So night time is pretty much here now. Obviously prime time for the basils, if they're in here. This area has been pretty kind to me recently with the bass. We've got a uh, big uh, spring tides, nine metre high tonight. Probably an hour away till high water. So fingers crossed, there's a uh, few fish around. Most uh, simple retrieve, as you see there. Nothing too fancy, just a good twitch on the rod. And that's literally as simple as it is. All we're fishing over here is just boulders and weed. So there's hopefully there's a few fish in here. Yes, we're in. We had no luck at the other mark. But sure enough, I've come to the uh, mark I started. And yeah, we're in. Only a small bass. Better, got a head torch. It'll be fun getting him up with this swell. Oh, I'm happy with that. The other marker, when I went around the corner, it was a no go, that's for sure. Absolutely, swell must have been about 10 foot high. Oh, God, he's diving around the back of that head. Ooh. Try and bring him in with this wave. Oh, all right, try and lever him around here. Not a bad bass, this, all right. Lovely fish. Oh, come here, buddy. Gotta be so careful with the uh, tide. Oh, yeah. Pound and a half bass, those. Two pounds. Lovely job. Let's get him up. There we are. Whoa, all this slippery around here. He's nailed that uh, JJ Minnow. But uh, yeah, that's a nice bass, that. Check that out. Lovely job. There we are. A, lo Ooh. a lovely basil. Probably about a pound and a half, I suppose. Well, yeah, he took me by surprise. Well, uh, yeah, lovely. I'm well happy with that. Nice big old mouth. First, the JJ's minnow in a sardine collar. So, yeah, not going to waste any more time. Going to get a release of it and get that lower back in the water. See if there's any big ones in there. So, we're selling revival in the pool for a couple of minutes there. That's got a wet foot. Lovely job. Well, yeah, you are. Nice little basil. Happy days. I ain't going too close to the water, that's for sure, because it is absolutely pulsing there. But uh, yeah, there we go. Nice little star. Gonna pop him in down here. Find his way out there. There he goes. Come on, buddy. Off he goes out with a tie. You beauty. Let's get back out there and see if we got another one. So I'm pretty happy with that. Well, yeah, that tide's getting pretty sketchy now. So I'll be having a few more chops here. And then calling it a day, because I don't want to get uh, yeah, swamped by a big wave, especially in the dark, that's for sure. But uh, yeah, the uh, JJ Minnow doing the job. But that swell is big. But big swells mean bass. But so we're not doing anything special with the retrieve on this lure either. Quite slow, just the odd twitch. But yeah, see on the horizon now how big the waves are. Big old swell. But 
Right, I've got a few more trucks here, I think, and they're going to call it a uh, night. I think I might come back tomorrow morning. Hopefully, the wind will uh, drop down a little bit by then. We'll come out in the dark, and yeah, let's see if we can nail another one. Because that wasn't a bad fish, that one, to be honest. Pushing on to a couple of pounds. Oh yeah, so we're fishing over boulders here. I was starting to lose a little bit of hope before that bass, to be honest. So we're out for round two now. It's the second evening of the bass fishing. So we had, yeah, part one. Now we're on to part two. Lost three old night. So hopefully, uh, yeah, the GoPro don't pick up too much uh, wind. But uh, yeah, quite a bit of a breeze, a nice bit of chop in the water. So we're heading down to the mark now. So we're using soft plastics tonight. And uh, hopefully we can nail a bass or two. So for the start of the session, we're gonna be using a little minnow like that. And that's 24 or 28 gram, a uh, weedless lure. We're bumping it over the sand, good action on it. So uh, yeah, hopefully that does the business. But if not, we've got all different varieties of lures for this uh, bass fishing tonight. As you can see in front of me, the uh, tide's starting to pump in quite nicely. Tide's gonna race in pretty quick. We've got an 8.7 high tonight, currently two hours of the flood of the tide. So uh, yeah, got a bit of rain. So hopefully, if we get a bit damp, we can get a big bass in between. Come on. All right, let's get our first cast in. Very shallow. But yeah, the bass should be close in. Feeding any cr on any cr uh, crustaceans coming in, sorry. In the uh, white water, nice slow retrieve. Literally dragging it along the bottom. Just with the odd twitch. In the nighttime, the bass can be finicky, or they'll just nail you. Yeah, we're in. Look at that, first cast. First cast, probably in about a foot of water. That didn't take long, did it? <laughs> it shows. All we're fishing, I say, is a uh, boulder bed to the left of me. And uh, yeah, straight out in front of me, it's just sand. But first cast, only a whipper snapper. But I'll take it for a first bass in the session. Gotta be careful with the waves coming in. Oh, he's trying to get behind that head there. Surfing the waves. <laughs> only a little bass, but we'll take that. As a starter, come here, buddy. Oh. Lovely to see on the first chop though. Get some safer ground. We'll get you a better show of it. There we are, lovely job. Great star. So there we are, one basil down. First up minnow. Yeah, I'll take that for a starter. Beautiful. First cast in that surf. And sure enough, Mr. Basil takes the lure. You can go back nicely uh, hooked to the top there. Only probably half a pound. But uh, yeah, I'm not going to waste any time. Let's get it back. Let's see if we can get a bigger one. There we are. One last little show of the basil. Beautiful little fish. So uh, yeah, it's getting back in the surf. We've got the chest waders on tonight so we can come out a little bit more to release them. Cheers, buddy. We'll see you next time. Oh, nice big wave. Off he goes. Great is that surf. Let's get back out there and see if we can get a bigger one. Right, let's go back out there again for the second cast. I said, if you're in the right spot, you'll get the bass. All I was doing is reeling really slowly with that one, just with that odd twitch, and he hit me on the twitch. But hopefully as that tide pulses in, the bigger fish will come in here. That's the theory anyway. Theory bass fishing. Yeah, we're, oh, I got hit again straight away. Oh, there's some fish in here. Small though, fit yet a bit. Oh, I missed him. Of oh, course, a big wave. It just shows if we're here at the right time, you'll get the fish. Maybe we picked up a little bit of weed that time, maybe. But it just shows, yeah, they're in that swell, in that surf. 
Uh, so that's the lure we're using. Doesn't pick up too, too much weed. Straight back out there again. We're not casting too, too far, really. Nothing special. But yeah, they're in that surf. Come on, where's that big five pounder? Everyone there somewhere hiding. Oh, got another tap. Oh, that's a big weight. Oh yeah, great fun in the night time, that's for sure. Just always have your wits about you. Say that five's pulsing in. Yeah, be safe, but enjoy it. That's it, it's literally as simple as it. Just walking up the beach. And now, uh, yeah, fishing into the surf. And the bass are in there. See, it's, there we are, we're, at the, we're on the beach here. Literally got to our knees, a cast behind the waves, and the bass are sat in there, feeding on any of the weed. But uh, yeah, the tide's racing in pretty quick as well. So hopefully we can get those bigger fish tonight. So it's not going too well after that one bass. I had that one bass first cast. At that second cast, got hit by a bass, and ever since then, it's been absolutely dead. Well, I reckon I'm going to call it a night there, guys. It's absolutely dead since that last bass. The uh, tide's picked up more, the rain's coming in, the swell's got bigger, it's got windier. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to call it a night there. Hopefully you've enjoyed this trip. And, uh, yeah, we'll catch you on the sea again very soon. If you enjoyed this uh, yeah, two-part video, please hit the like button and subscribe if you're new around here as well. Cheers for watching. I will catch you out again soon.